Okay, good day. So, ang topic natin ngayon is about test taking strategies. So, next slides. Okay. So, its test questions consist of three parts. Okay. So, yung question daw, yung may tatlong parts. Okay. So, number one is introductory statement to stem. Number three, the four options. Okay. So, sa introductory, ito yung mga concept or subject na pinag-usapan doon sa question. So, ito yung number 2 naman, yung stem niya, which ask na na, uh, ito yung ano, ito yung mga question. So, how, what, which, when, or, hmm, man, yun naman yun. Okay, so, yung four options naman, ito yung A, B, C, or ay, yun yun, o, from which you must select the answer okay so meron tayong option a option b option c and option d okay so next slide uh, example ito yun ito yung introductory nyo the mother asks you the possible contraindication of immunization so yung stem naman which of the following situation were in immunization is being contra indicated alright so yung option option A malnutrition option B diarrhea then option C mild respiratory infection and D age okay so doon tayo sa keyword so yung keyword niya is contra indications of immunization so, alam natin, contraindication ng immunization is yung fever. Diba? May fever yun. Above 38.7 uh, or something like that. 38.5. And then, yung mga immunocompromised patient. So, tingnan mo dyan sa option kung sino ang pinaka-the best answer dyan. Okay? So, ang sagot natin dyan is age. Siya yung pinaka may immunocompromised. Next. So, skip, return, and check. Okay? Kung mahirap yung question, skip mo muna. And then, babalikan mo na lang. Tama? Okay? Next, rule number two. Read the questions carefully before looking at the options. Identify keywords in the stem. Okay? So, keywords, sabi natin kanina. Kanina na dun sa una, yung contraindication. Tama pa? So, ito yung technique natin. Read the question carefully. So, habang binabasa mo yung question niya, yung introductory sa yung stem, um, iniisip mo na yung sagot. So, parang nagpa-process ka na ng mga sagot mo doon. So, pag tingin mo lang sa option, kung nandun na yung naisip mo, ayun na yun. Tama ba? Okay. So, next, uh, watch out for these words. Okay? So, yung first, primary, initial, early, best, most, least, most important, priority, ito yung may accept, inappropriate, appropriate, yung mga ganun. Okay? So, paka-insert ko lang. O kaya, kung may time, sulat nyo para mas maganda. Ako daw, nung nag-exam, sinusulat ko siya para malaman kung um, ano dun, talagang nandun yun. Okay? Ay, except, sinusulat ko din. Except, ganun. Okay? So, example, an early signs of respiratory distress you might observe is Okay, so yung keyword natin dyan is early. Early, tango ba? Early. So, 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 so sabi natin sa early RDS, ang pinaka-compensatory uh, mechanism sa RDS is magkakaroon ka muna ng increased pulse rate. Okay? So, yung late po dyan is yung late, yung cyanosis. So, ang ansagot natin dyan is letter A. A. Next, rule number four. Answer difficult questions by eliminating the obviously incorrect response first. Then, select the best of the remaining questions. Quickly reduce your options to only two. Okay, kung mahirap daw talaga yung questions, difficulty questions po tayo, mm -hmm. eliminate nyo po yung dalawa. Okay, so, tinan nyo muna kung ano yung pinaka-unrelated doon or... Basta, yung hindi siya nagsasuggest doon sa mga option, tanggalin mo na lang. So, para maging 50-50. Tama. Okay. Next. Uh, example. When teaching the client about orthostatic hypotension, you should explain that it can be modified by. Okay. So, keyword natin. Concept natin is 
orthostatic hypotension. Alam natin yung orthostatic is from position, positioning. So, hypotension is mababa ang BP. So, ang tamang sagot dyan, A, B, C, or D. Okay? So, check natin. We are in support those uh, continuously. Mali. Lying down for 30 minutes after taking medication. Nandun yung lying down. Pero, ang concept natin is about taking medication. So, mali din. Avoid tasks that require high energy expenditure. So, meron naman yung positioning dyan. Wala din. So, sitting on the edge of the bed a short time before arising is the best answer. So, ang sagot, letter D. Okay? Next, rule number 5. Select responses that are therapeutic, show respect, and communicate acceptance. Eliminate response, okay, that are uh, bizarre, bizarre, inappropriate, or punitive. Okay? So, tandaan, ang pinaka-plastic po na sagot doon, or pinaka-therapeutic, yan. <laughs> yan na yung word kasi, pinaka-plastic, pinaka-therapeutic, yun na po yung sagot. Okay? So, example, a victim of domestic violence states to the nurse, if only I could change and be how many, huh? how my companions wants me to be. I know things would be different, which would be uh, the best response by the nurse. Okay. So, ano yung pinaka-therapeutic dyan? So, okay, tingnan natin yung A, B, C, at saka D. Therapeutic muna. The violence is temporary. Oh, it's not temporary. Okay, so, next I will be perhaps... From the word perhaps, if you understood the need, oh, hindi na rin. No one deserves to be beaten. Hmm, parang ano to ah, parang false reassurance now. Okay? So, batterers lost self-control because of their own internal reasons, not because of what their half-partner did or did not do. Okay? So, kung pipili mo dyan, COD, ang pinaka-therapeutic to dyan is letter D. Okay? Next, Common test taking errors o oh, tandaan, not recognizing or remembering subject matter, mm, not understanding subject matter, o oh, kaya nga magbasa, 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 read, 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 read more, watch more, di ba? Okay, not recognizing item or idea, mm, neto, hindi nagkikita, not recognizing principle or rationale or correct answer, okay, reason out, reason out po ang mga answer nyo bago palitan, di ba? Mm -hmm. Kung walang magandang rason, wag nang palitan, yes? Miss keyword, okay, yung keyword natin, tandaan, underline, underline mga keyword, not reading all distractors, okay, mga distractors natin, except, okay, or inappropriate, mga ganun, okay, paki, sulat na lang din, or in circle, not understanding the questions, nako, nag-aaral ka pa, hindi mo alam yung question, ha? okay, reading into questions, using incorrect rationale for choosing response, changing the answer, okay, sabi natin kanina, wag magpapalit ng sagot kung walang Okay, good reason. Okay, next. Mm, example. A client is admitted with the diagnosis of meningitis. Which finding would the nurse expect in assessing this client? Okay, tandaan. Meningitis infection of the meninges of the brain. Okay, so ano yung keyword natin dito? Mm, ayon diagnosis niya daw. Okay, so anong pinaka uh, common sign and symptoms or patognomonic sign and symptoms? Okay, meron tayong Koenig's or Brodzinski. So, hahanapin mo na lang dyan si Brodzinski or si Koenig's. Okay? So, ang tamang sagot natin dyan, merong dalawa, hyperextension, hyperplexion, okay, plexion, and plexion. So, ang tamang sagot dyan is, okay, uh, doon tayo, um, hyperextension of the neck, Okay, so the demo rin yan. Pwede yung demo. Meron bang hyperplexion of the neck with rebound flexion of the legs? Walang rebound. Okay, so kung may passive daw, tandaan doon sa Koenig's passive yung flexion of the neck, kasasama daw si, mag-flex daw po si knees or hip. So ang tamang sagot dyan is letter boy. Okay, next, rule 8 is manage your time effectively during test taking. Okay, so may dalawang oras lang tayo, kaya manage natin yung oras. Titignan natin. Mm -hmm. Pwede rin yung 1 minute each question kung kaya. Okay, so then double check. Dati nung nag-exam ako, oh, 3 times ko chinect yung, ano, 3 times chinect ko yung, mm, yung papel ko. Okay. 3 times, 3 times talaga, chinect ko na rin binagyan ko ng check mark okay? yung mga tamang sagot okay? <laughs> ganun yung gagawin niya next, 
okay, example, during an examination of a 2-year-old child with tentative diagnosis of Wilms tumor, okay? So, ang patag ng munik sign natin ng Wilms tumor is meron siyang, anong meron? Sa chan. Okay, meron siyang uh, sis. Tama, sis. Kasi tumor is sis. Okay, so lalaki ang chan yan. So, titignan mo doon ang keyword natin, Wilms tumor, concept, uh, Wilms tumor din. So, sabi, which statement by the mother nurse would be most concerned? So, saan ka daw concerned dyan? Para maraman mong may Wilms tumor. Okay, saan yung chance, saan yung chance, 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 chance. Okay, nasa ways, around the way, sabi niya. So, the answer is letter, letter C. Okay, next, eliminate similar options. Okay, tandaan, eliminate, uh, eliminate similar options. Kung parehas sila, ang anong sinasabi, tatanggalin na lang agad. Okay, so, tandaan, kung ano yung mali, ah, uh, ano doon? Uh, yung naiiba. Yun na yun, di ba? So, a nurse is assigned to care of a group of clients on on review the client's medical records. The nurse determines uh, that which client is at risk for excess fluid volume. Okay, excess fluid volume tayo. Okay, yung ileus to me, diuresis, gasolin. Okay, nasa ano lang yan? Nasa GIT. So, yung client with renal failure is the best answer yan. Tama ba? Okay, used to me, out yan, diuresis, naga out din, gastrointestinal suctioning, out din, so renal failure, walang lumalabas, so excess fluid intake yan, or volume yan. Okay, so the answer is letter D. Okay, so eliminate words that contain absolute words, all, always, every, must, none, never, only. So yan, tatanggalin daw lahat yan ha, pero hindi, lahat, hindi naman lahat yan. Okay, next, so uh, example is, a nurse is providing safety instruction to the mother of a child with Hemophilia. Okay. From the word hemophilia, meron siyang problema sa... Okay. Ano yan? Mm, hemo. Hemo from the word hemo is dugo. Dama? Okay. May bleeding to. So, saan dyan? Hanapin mo dyan kung... Okay. Sabi niya, eh, safe environment for the child. Okay. So, puputek mo siya para hindi siya ma-risk for injury. Okay. So, risk for injury. Hanapin mo dyan. Uh, a. Remove toys with sharp edges. Pwede. Okay. Allow the child to play with toys only if a parent is present. O, naka, ano naman yan. O, no? place helmet and elbow pads on the... Oh, every day. Oh, no. Allow the child to play indoors only. So, the best answer is letter A. Okay. Next, look for umbrella options. If you note that more than one uh, option appears to be correct, look for the umbrella option or global option. So, in general... A statement and may contain the ideas of the other options. So, example, ito, a nurse in emergency rooms receives a telephone call from medical services and is told that there are several victims who survived a plane crash and are suffering from cold. Wow, dami no? Ilan sila? So, medical services called. Okay, the initial nursing options, the emergency nurse is which of the following? Okay, tandaan, emergency room service. Sabi niya, tapos meron. Okay, okay, suffering from crash or pain crash. So, anong gagawin dyan kung madami yung, madami yung client na pupunta ngayon? Okay? So, ang gagawin na lang is call the nursing supervisor to activate the emergency or agency disaster plan. So, the best answer is letter C. So, yung C is yung umbrella option natin. So, nandun, content na yung D, B, and A. So, true and false response. Okay, true and false response. Tignan na lang kung ano yung totoo o kaya hindi. Tama ba? So, read, 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 read. Next, number 9. Do not change answers without good reasons. Okay? Huwag mong papalitan muna ang boyfriend, girlfriend kung wala namang magandang rason. Tama ba? Okay, next. 27. Question is, the nurse caring for a client with an unstable spinal cord injury. Okay, tandaan, pag T7, T7, okay? So, ang affected na rin is lower extremities. Lower extremities, okay? Nakaka-position ba siya? Hindi, tama? Okay? So, ang tamang sagot dyan is, letter, positioning, positioning is, place client on a pressure-reducing support surface. Okay? Affected po dyan is T7. Next, so, yun yung priority natin, letter, Boy, 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 boy. Okay, so, yan po. Tama? Yeah, yan na po muna. Okay, please subscribe na lang. And, okay, click your bell para, ano, updated kayo lagi. Okay, thank you.